Watch right. this. Read. We're almost through. But now in Christ Jesus, he once were far off, but have been brought near by the blood of Christ. Mm -hmm. For he himself is our peace. Wait a minute. Our peace. Yes. He's peace with God. Yes. And he's peace with each other. Yes. Don't, don't, don't walk around here saying you got Jesus in you and you beefing with folks. Come on. Oh, Come on. Right. Right. Yeah. He, he, didn't, he didn't die so you can beef with everybody. He said he is our peace. Say that. Come on. He, he is our peace. He's not giving us. He is the peace. Uh, wait, y'all don't understand. I used to, I, I used to be, I used to be a bouncer at, at the club back in the day. You know, I was a little swole back then. You know, I was a little swole back then. And, 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 and you got good at when you walked up on the scene, bringing peace. And so when, when, when I walked up on the scene, I became the peace because they don't have peace until I walk up. Whoa! I'll hit run, but I'll hurt my hip. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen. When Jesus died, immediately he became the peace. And so anybody who steps in line with him, you are at peace with God. And you are at peace with each other. Yes. And so in order for you to not be at peace, you got to be quenching the spirit. And the Bible is clear that you do not quench the spirit. Come on. Because the Holy Spirit that you got will be grieved. Right. Wow. Yes. Come on. And they treat each other back. That's not. Let me move. Come on. Listen. He is our peace. Yes. I know you want me to turn my plow, but. <laughs> you, you can't be in Christ and at each other. Come on. Right. You've been forgiven for too much to be acting like you don't got to forgive. Forgive us our debts as we forgive our debts. I understand offense, y'all. Yeah. Anybody understand? Jesus said that there will be offense. offenses will come, but that don't mean they gotta stay. They, they, don't, they don't have to stay because if anyone has a complaint, just as Christ has forgiven you, you also do. See, see, I, as as a leader, I gotta walk around prepared to forgive. Yes, yes, Talk about it. I, I have to be prepared yeah. to forgive yeah. because what I understand about human beings, right. y'all, is that they're going to do something to offend you. Right. I'm trying to tell you, walk around prepared to forgive because if you're not prepared, it's hard to forgive after it's happened to you if you weren't ready to forgive when it happened to you. Yes. Right. It may take you That's a couple good. of weeks. Oh, y'all ain't never good. been rocked by something. Y'all ain't right. never had somebody do something to you Come that on. rocked you and, and you weren't prepared to forgive them and so it took you weeks and months and some people still going for years. They still haven't gotten over it because they weren't prepared. He said, forgive us our debts as we. This thing is a continual thing and in Christ, there should be no unforgiveness because there's peace with God and with each other. My God.